guys 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 alex just detected the moose it's all the way down there in the meadow and i was able to see it that is so neat in last week's video we shared with you how we spent our morning hiking to ptarmigan lake and ptarmigan tunnel under the rain and how we run on the trail to save some time and do an additional side hike to iceberg lake on the same day a beautiful hike that opens up to a unique glacier fed lake iceberg lake trail is a 9.3 mile moderate hike with an elevation gain of 1450 feet the trailhead is located behind the Swift Current Motor Inn in Many Glacier area in Glacier National Park. This is the same trail that takes you up to Tarmigan Lake and Tarmigan Tunnel. And since we hiked Tarmigan Lake Trail early in the day, we started our hike at the intersection point that connects Tarmigan Trail and Iceberg Trail. This point is located roughly about 2.6 miles from the trailhead. So we are back at the intersection here after we finished Ptarmigan Lake and Ptarmigan Tunnel there, and I think we are going for Iceberg Lake which is 2.1 miles and I think we have plenty of time we are grooving on the Iceberg Trail and up there we can see some snow on the glacier and some sun rays are kind of shining some light to that area of the park. If you haven't seen sun sunlight in a while, Excuse that's exciting. Me. That is exciting. Okay. Yalla. Let's get going. Okay. We're hoping that we can get up there in an hour or less. So not stopping for much photos or snacks or whatever. Never mind about the sun we were talking about earlier. But check these beautiful colors and the waterfall and the ice. And we were told we will have to climb up a little bit. So the thing is we didn't download the map from all trails. And because the plan was not to do this hike to be honest. Uh, we plan to do the iceberg, not the iceberg the tunnel now we wanted to do this one at the same time wow. hello hello i was wondering where that sound was coming from and then i realized that there's a waterfall there yeah. it's really nice a berry! I took so many pictures of bears. You guys, make sure you check Instagram. I'll be posting everything. Oh! 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 Okay. Berries. Berries. <laughs> Come on. Berries. These are the berries. <laughs> no, I mean these. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> I think uh, we're halfway there in terms of time, baby. I, I think we're pushing back that we're doing 20 minute miles right now. What, what? I see we're halfway there. Wow, I like these colors. I want to live here. More berries. More berries. They are red and beautiful. Can I hit me with that camera? It's in my chest. You guys want to see where my camera is? Okay, do you want to close the door? 
Thank you. Thank you, thank you. So here are some wildflowers for you guys. There is this white flower like my boyfriend. There's this white one. Thick baby. Uh-huh. There's humidity on the center bed. Okay. Okay, let me pass you please. Excuse me, excuse me. Thank you. There's this beautiful one again. This one, I think Alex is trying to picture this one. Yeah, because it has water. Cloudy, and then these flowers. And then these. Yeah, and then. What are the odds that we get there and the sky becomes clear? We can see all the beautiful mountains there clearly. Huh? Yeah. Like so much. Howdy, Alex. Howdy, Beebs. <laughs> glacier, the snow, snow belts. They are part of the glacier that's feeding the lake. So that's where we are going towards, I believe. It seems like the definition of being a glacier is that you have to move <laughs> a certain distance every year. And it looks like these are not going to be glaciers in a little bit. Not because there's not going to be a lot of ice there. They're just not going to be moving enough. Yeah, so, so. maybe even less than 100 years. Not specifically this glacier, but a couple of glaciers in the park will not be there anymore. So, yeah. Okay. How far do you think we are, Alex? Well, I mean, I can see it. Oh, uh, my fate. Like from the way it seems like the train's gonna loop around the side here, I guess a mile flat. Neat. Neat. Night. Yeah, More we'll flowers. I tell you guys, someone just told us that they saw mountain goats. And mountain goats, everyone who comes to the park gets to see mountain goats. Except me, apparently. Hi. We saw some outside the mini glacier. No, that's not the mountain goats I'm talking about. Those are sheep these are white mountain goats ah, okay, okay. not the same thing but anyway i'm hoping to see a goat and i'm hoping to see a moose oh did i tell you guys that growing up i thought moose was just like unicorn it doesn't exist because in the parts of the world where i come from there i nothing like a moose and so far as you're concerned i remember if you don't see one, then that's still true. Exactly. If I don't see it, it doesn't exist. So, wish us good fortune. Actually, it will be late by the time you wish us good fortune. This video will be already posted. It'll be too late. And there is a little water crossing here. Mini bridge. Oh, wow. <laughs> that is neat. It's like all around too, you can see it all. Wow! Wow! And it's clear! Clear water! Glacier fat water! Bobo! Take this! Hello! That's Biba! You know her from How to Brush Your Teeth in the Wilderness. <laughs> This is wonderful. Okay, keep going. Whoa. That was a neat little water crossing. This first lake, which is not the lake we're looking for. But it's also pretty neat. This area, this meadow, at this point, um, shouldn't be accessible and is under restoration and such. But that's lake number one. Pretty awesome. Now we're gonna head to the second lake. 
which is the one we're aiming for. I was really not focusing when I was up there because that was gorgeous. But are you ready? Look at that. And then the white and the blue. Okay. I don't think there's anyone up here. Yeah, I think we're the one. Wow. I think I'm just gonna make a big old mess of it. What's happened? It just, uh, they're, I guess they got so, there's so much moisture in the air mm. that they're stuck in here. Let's see. Can I see? Okay, hold this. I'm so. trying not to make a mess because I don't want to leave. That's why I've been trying to do it. Oh, there you go. Well, <laughs> I've even got the magic oh, fingers. No, it's so many of them. It's okay, it's okay. I'll, I'll handle that part. Yep. Why you have a girlfriend? <laughs> easy three, easy. All right, where'd my lid go? All right. Okay, we are leaving this very beautiful place behind, and we are going. <laughs> he's making fun of me because he's too tall that I can't. Okay, you guys got what I mean. But anyway, this beautiful place, we're gonna leave it behind and we're gonna trace our way back. You leave the same trail you come in, so keep that in mind. Yeah, it's like about, what, six miles, we said? Totally, yeah, we have six miles. It's a long day. It is a very long day, I'm tired, and I'm so excited for some prime rib. And Alex is pain. <laughs> You're pain. Let's do this. Hey, someone told us earlier that they saw a moose. So I'm still hoping that Mr. Moose is here somewhere. Moose! Moose, where are you? Moose! The problem is you're trying to keep away the moose, keep away the bear, but to attract the moose. The moose, I know. So you got this anti-bear bell, which is sadly also acting as an anti-moose bell, probably. It's not making enough noise, Alex. Alex. What is this little trail here, huh? It just goes to other areas of the lake. Hmm. Should we go? I say we get going back. Okay. We don't want to get stuck in the dark. That is true. Okay, let's go. Especially because it's going to get colder as it drops. It's going to get into the 30s. Yep. And that's not just by the glacier. That's going to be everywhere. Oh, 30 degrees is zero degrees Celsius. 32 degrees is zero degrees. It's 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Zero 
degrees so we are at about what minus one celsius say what we are at minus one right now degrees celsius minus one would be 30 point oh 1.9 30.1 anyway or is it 1.8 i see someone with an umbrella can be a moose okay there's a little bit of a climb here other than that it will be flat and straight <sighs> and nice oh Ooh, Ali. yeah huh? yeah seems like it seems like someone else is going to check the trail and we're not the last people so good luck to them I think they're almost here Those oranges were so damn tasty. These meadows are very nice. Okay. We thought we were the last people on the trail. We oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> saw a guy on the way down, he said he jumped in. Really? I was like, man, I'm cold already. I didn't even I jump know. in. <laughs> 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 yeah, I was impressed. I, I saw them and I was like, oh, yeah, I guess oh, wow, the icebergs beautiful. fall off the glacier. And then I was like, well, actually, I guess they're not icebergs until they hit the water. <laughs> and then there are no icebergs at all. And I was like, why is it called Iceberg Lake? <laughs> That's neat. Yeah. Still beautiful though. Yeah, it sure is. I that was a great it hike. Up said there. If, it's, if, it's great. Say, if it's not too late in the summer, you can still see the icebergs out there on the lake, or if it's not a hot, hot summer. Oh, like okay. Yeah. yeah. Did you guys make it up to Grinnell Overlook? No, no we haven't. Yet. A big mushroom. With you, I can make three and a half omelets. Mm. Can you take a video? Yes. Oh, okay. Well, because my camera is not. I thought you were going to just take a picture anything. with the GoPro. No, my camera is so foggy because it was raining and I didn't protect it as well as I should. So now, when I see nice mushrooms, I'm going to take a video instead. Understand? Okay, bridge crossing again. I can feel my wet jacket rubbing against my back. Ooh! Wet! Okay. This crazy guy told us that he, he was swimming in the lake. I know I couldn't even put my hand in that water <laughs> my hands now are giving me like electric shocks he's either crazy or crazy okay so we're trying to go full speed here to get to the sign in the next less than 15 minutes. Hey guys! Hello. Hello. Thank you. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> oh man, we're running. Because when we get to the sign, which is the intersection then we still have 2.8 miles and we don't want to get stuck here in the dark <laughs> we both forgot to bring our headlights really? <laughs> you think we'll make it?
we are at the intersection five minutes past the time that we planned for no two minutes and 20 seconds look oh. at this look at my watch <laughs> very nice this, this way yeah. <laughs> 602. Oh, but we were running. Yeah, we left the glacier at 5:30. I... My feet. We were running, running, but we were we were moving. Oh, baby. Gross. We can get back by 6:30. Can you take a picture of this and the picture of the other one? Picture you found? Oh. No, just a picture for the blog. I didn't have pictures of both of these. You do? I'm going the other way. Huh? I don't know if I can get my phone to work right now. Okay. So wet. We'll keep going then, just the same way we came in initially, but that was the intersection. Okay, so... In this section, it seems like the fog is kind of clearing up and we can see the mountain a little better than earlier today. Which is nice. We're almost halfway back, baby, from the sign. Oh, God. Yeah, you don't ask guys about how my feet feel. No. I don't know, I think we covered about 15 miles. Almost so 15? far we've done 13.6. 13.6 That miles. neglects the fact that I paused the recording for a little bit. I think I'm starting to see Swift Current Lake. Yeah, I'm on board with that. Sounds good to me. Hello! Hello! Guys, 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 Alex just detected the moose. It's all the way down there in the meadow. And we did the autofocus in the camera and I was able to see it. That is so neat. I want to see more. I want to see more. I want to see more. Look, 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 this wow. is him now. Look, look for the video. This is what we're oh seeing. Oh my God, look, look. This is, what, this is the moose. <laughs> I want to see, I want to see more. Give me, give me, give me. Wow, it's real. It's not like unicorn. <laughs> Ooh, baby, I'm gonna switch to 4K. Is that okay? Moving his antlers, moving his head. See if he walks around a little bit. He walked around a little bit already. Being very, very deliberate. Mm. With that, we concluded our four day adventure in Glacier National Park. We hope you enjoyed all the trails we were able to cover. Your trekking pals, Habiba and Alex, and we'll see you soon on another adventure. <laughs>